Welcome back to another edition of our at-home workouts. This is Friday. We have an 18-minute AMRAP for you. This is the finale of our AMRAP week. We have a 30-second run in place. That should be interesting to do. It will probably be a little awkward in your living room running in place. We have 10 burpees, 16 deadlifts. If you don't have anything to deadlift, then we'll use a single leg glute bridge. 20 lunges, one for one, every time you take a step will count as one repetition, and then 24 plank jacks. This is a great workout for if you don't have anything to use, if you do have some stuff to use, then you'll be able to use those weights for your deadlifts and for your lunges. Let's get everyone warmed up with 10 air squats. You know, it's always not gonna be my favorite. I'm always gonna start with that. I think squatting is the most important piece of the puzzle today. As you can see, Kevin, with the forward facing air squat, we have the heels down, glutes engaged, nice big chest, knees driving out. And as usual, we're always gonna do those 10 air squats. It's always gonna be our warm up because we love them so much. Then we'll get into five slow burpees followed by five normal speed burpees. Remember, hands go down. Kev's gonna show us a step out and step in. For those of you who are uncomfortable with driving those feet back, Make sure that chest hits the ground. Peel that chest off the ground slowly. We're gonna do five nice and slow, and then five a little bit faster. And now, the goal of the workout is when you do your burpees, instead of stopping on your burpee, the goal is to keep moving at some pace. It's knowing how what a fast burpee is like, what a slow burpee is like, what a medium burpee is like, and that'll help you be consistent throughout the whole entire 10. And on your last burpee, you're actually gonna stay on the ground. We're gonna get into some supermans. We literally wanna pick our heels to the ceiling, put our arms out nice and forward in front of us, and raise your chest off the ground, try to raise your thighs off the ground, and relax, 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 and up. And you're gonna do this on your own with a one second hold for five more repetitions. So five more from now. One second hold, and then we're back down. This is gonna help get our lower back engaged. Once you're done with your five, we can go on our feet, and we're gonna give 10 good mornings without anything on our backs. Really wanna have that nice flat back, hips pressing against the back wall, wherever your hips are, pretend like there's a wall behind you, and we're pushing those hips back while maintaining a flat back. We don't want that back to round. Kev's gonna show us what we don't want on the rounded back. We don't want to round that back. We want to keep a big chest. So poke that chest out and keep that chest out the whole entire time. If I didn't say we're, we're going to do, do 10 here. And for you guys, it looks like it's about 10 already. Right from here, let's go into a, a forward stepping lunge and then step back. Forward stepping lunge and then step back, alternating every time. We're going to do 10, five on each side. On that front foot, you want that ankle to be over the knee. You want your ankle and need to be in one straight line for when we do our lunges. We're gonna do five and five. We wanna avoid leaning forward in the lunge. It's really a lunge step and drop down. So you don't wanna do what Kev's doing. He's really over-exaggerating the point, however you get it. And if you look at Alyssa, she's nice and upright as she steps, back knee places down, and she is vertical from shoulders to knee is in one straight line. And then the forward knee to the ankle is also in one straight line. And we're gonna go back to the ground for our plank jacks. Our plank jacks, we wanna be in this upward plank position like a push-up position. Before we do anything, we're gonna make sure that we're stacked. Jake, Alyssa, you can see from here, has those shoulders stacked over our wrist. Remember, if we need to ease up on the wrist a little bit, we could turn our fingers out facing opposite of each other. So instead of having those fingers face forward, as you can see, Kelsey has moved her hands so her fingers are facing basically in opposite directions. And from here, you wanna squeeze those glutes and you wanna jack those feet out and then we're gonna jack them back in. Basically like a jumping jack, but while in this plank position. And we're gonna go out to in. Every time you go out and in is one, we're gonna do 20 here. So out and in is one, out and in is two, out and in is three. We want to avoid really booty popping. We want to keep our glutes nice and tight, our hips nice and tight, our back nice and tight, everything nice and tight in from, from our chest down to our, our glutes. We want to stay nice and tight. Now the workout is gonna include all those movements. So let's see them run in place. Let's see how funny we could get these guys to run in place. I'm not gonna make you go for 30 seconds. Let's see what uh, 10 seconds looks like. Go ahead. Running in place. High knees. 
There is no modification for this. You can do this in your house. Unless someone's sleeping under you downstairs, then, uh, then, then that might be some trouble. Again, it's an 18 minute AMRAP. Every time you do those lunge steps, it will count as one. During the workout, Jake's gonna show you how you're gonna do this with an actual barbell with the deadlifts with the lunges, and Alyssa in the front left is gonna be doing body weight only. Kelsey, if you have a kettlebell, torpedo, a dumbbell, will be perfect. She's gonna be showing those modifications. And then Kevin is gonna be using a slam ball, a wall ball, and then during at some point in the workout, he'll grab an odd object, maybe a case of water bottles, and he'll use that as well. Okay, so at some point he'll jump out of screen, or he'll do this now, and go get it. We are going to start in 10 seconds, have fun. And I'm, like usual, we're gonna let the music ride out and you guys ride out with the music for the whole entire 18 minutes. <laughs> Follow along, hopefully you're having fun. One week of at-home workouts in the books. We're up in three, two, one, go.
just in case you want a time check, we are done in two and a half minutes. Twenty seconds remaining. Ten seconds left, guys. Friday's workout is almost complete. We are done in five, four, three, two, and time. Great week. In the books, AMRAP week is over. We'll have something fresh and new for you next week. If you need anything in the meantime, let us know. We'll be in touch. Have a great weekend, guys. Oh.